Let us learn how I made this beautiful infographic in Microsoft PowerPoint. So if you want to be an expert, watch the video till the end. Let's begin the topic. Here I have already taken a blank slide. Let me go to insert, go to chart, go to pie chart, click on this 3D pie chart and click on OK. As soon as I click on the pie chart, a pie chart will be inserted. You may change your values from here let me write here 9 here 3 let me increase this you may write here 1.5 and 1.2 or you may add more quarter from here now my demo pie chart is ready now let me close this then click on this let me delete the text box here and from here then select this pie chart go to chart design select this one the style 10 then let me click on right button go to format data series go to effect go to 3d format from top bevel select this one the angle and from the bottom bevel also select the angle and this is looking perfect and let me delete this quarter and hold down the shift key and reduce the size and click on this and place it here like this and let me click on here and drag the mouse and place it like this then you may change the color of the slice let me select this one double click on this then go to fill and line go to solid fill you may change the fill color from here let me select this color then let me select this one go to solid fill and select the fill color from here then let me select this one go to solid fill and you may select any color from here let me select this one and this is looking perfect now go to insert go to shape pick a oval shape hold down the shift key and drag it here like this shape outline no outline go to shape effect go to preset and click on the preset 3 then go to insert go to shape pick a text box and drag it over here and write your text here select the font and place it like this select this one and this one press ctrl g to group them together and ctrl d to duplicate and place it here again press ctrl d to duplicate and place it here again press ctrl d to duplicate and place it here like this then let me select this one the shape and go to shape format go to shape fill go to eyedropper and select this fill color then select this one go to shape fill go to eyedropper and select this color select this one go to shape fill go to eyedropper and select this fill color and this is looking perfect now go to insert go to shape pick a cube shape hold down the shift key and drag it over here like this then go to shape outline make it no outline and go to shape fill go to eyedropper and select this fill color press ctrl d to make it duplicate and place it here go to shape fill eyedropper select this color again press ctrl d to duplicate go to shape fill eyedropper select this color press ctrl d to duplicate shape fill eyedropper and select this fill color select all of this and place it here like this and go to insert go to shape pick a text box right here r change the font color and change the font size change the font and place it here then select this one press ctrl d to duplicate and place this text box here ctrl d to duplicate place it here ctrl d to duplicate and place it here right here k i the risk and place it like this now i have to add some animation let me select this one go to animation go to add animation go to more entrance effect then let me select bounce and click on on click then let me select this one go to add animation click on Y effect option from bottom on click Then let me select this one go to add animation click on zoom on click after previous 
then let me select this one go to add animation click on wipe then let me select this one go to add animation click on zoom on click after previous then let me select this one go to animation painter and paint it over this then select this one go to animation painter and click on over this select this one animation painter click on this then then select this one click on animation painter and click on over here now i have to add more animation let me select this one go to animation click on wipe and effect option from left change the duration to two seconds then again click on this go to add animation click on wipe effect option from left change the duration to two seconds then select this one animation painter this one and let me select this one to animation painter and click on this one now let me watch the slideshow this is looking perfect so hope you found this video helpful if you like this video please share this video with your friends and family and don't forget to subscribe thank you